Okay, just a short news flash video. A fix for real world weather in ATC Pro has come up. Uh, on the ATC Pro forum, the user Jan, I hope I pronounced that somewhat adequately, posted that he had found a fix to the real world weather issue on GitHub. So I headed on over to GitHub and the user Jack Quester, or Jack Quester, maybe? I, I don't know. Uh, on his GitHub page, he describes the steps to take uh, to patch uh, a DLL called vxsimulator.dll. Uh, it's the DLL that handles the weather in ATC Pro. Now, my view is never, ever download DLLs and EXEs from unknown sources on the internet. That's a huge security risk. So the way to go is to follow the guide he has done how to patch this manually. But I'm lazy, so uh, I did patch mine uh, with the, the pre-compiled DLL uh, on GitHub. Uh, and it works like a charm for me. It's been 24 hours and I haven't noticed anything strange with my computers. There's still money in my bank account, so I should be safe, right? Uh, I, I can hear myself now that I say it, how extremely stupid that argument sounded, but well, I'm extremely stupid. So uh, my point is I did try the DLL, it works uh, for me. I don't encourage anyone else to go for this option, but follow the guide to manually patch the DLL, that should be safe because it's basically just um, changing the string uh, of the address to the weather service and you can check that that string is correct and, and that way you would know that you've patched the DLL correctly. And and I'm thinking if, if you wanted to like install a backdoor on someone's computer or, or on as many computers as possible rather, uh, wouldn't be easier to like hack the users of Apex Legends or, or uh, some other well-known game rather than, than try to attack users of ATC Pro. So, well, not a great argument for, for how to handle safety, but, but uh, that wasn't the intention of this video. The intention of the video is just to let you know that there has been a fix to the real-world weather for ATC Pro. And I figured I should bring that up because not everyone reads the forum. And if there's any one of you that has your own YouTube channel and you reach other ATC Pro users, I think you should spread the word so that as many players as possible can enjoy this feature. The link to the GitHub guide and the forum post that made me aware of this uh, is attached to the description of this video.